Hey everyone, my name is Victor Troja. I'm the wellness clinician here over at the Cincinnati Sports Club. And I just wanted to talk about a few points uh, regarding our club being open and reasons why you should be healthy and be active. One of the main things that I see here is this misconception of staying away is staying safe. Now, if you think about that, staying away basically means reducing your activity level, reducing engagement with members, reducing engagement with our employees here. And one of the things that I think the club prides themselves on the most is that you're able to stay here and you're able to interact with other people in a safe and a socially adjustable environment. I wanted to answer a pretty common question and it's why should I be able to come into the gym and how can I feel comfortable doing so? Well, I just want you to remember that as an employee here, all the employees at the Cincinnati Sports Club are stewards for your health and well-being. So when you come into this environment, we care about your health as much as you do. We're trying to create something that's safe, controlled, and in an environment that you know that you can better yourself. So my challenge to you is next time you come in, really take a look around and see, wow, this environment feels comfortable. This is a place where I can see myself improving and knowing that you're not coming in with a huge risk. You wouldn't go into battle without preparing your body beforehand. One of the best things that exercise can do for you is boost your immune system. It not only helps your cortisol levels, but it prepares your body to fight off infections and viruses. By coming to the club, you can do one of the most essential things for your body right now, not only in this pandemic for the upcoming flu and cold season. So please, Take a minute to think about one of the benefits of coming to the club to help your own immunity. Just remember that being active isn't just getting in shape. It's mental, it's social, and it's physical. So try to remind that self, yourself about that detail next time that you come into the gym. One of the things that I try to preach to my patients and clients is a healthy lifestyle is habitual. It's things that are made on repetition and things that are done for people to continue their lifelong goal of being healthy. But on the same point, bad habits can become habitual too. So by taking out exercise and taking out being active, you're also creating and setting yourself up for failure in the future to have an active lifestyle. So try to think about that when you realize that you used to come to the gym three times a week and now you're not coming at all. So next time you think about coming into this environment, think I'm creating a lifelong habit for myself. We're in a difficult time and some of the things that I'm really seeing here it would be eye-opening for those of you who have not yet stepped into the club. The club honestly doesn't have its busy times right now. As somebody who works out here and sees patients and clients on the fitness floor, at any given time I can go out there and I know that I'm in safe and controlled environment. I don't see overcrowding, I don't see people not taking care of equipment. I don't see people taking off their mask on purpose. One of the most important things for you to remember is that everybody here, employees and members included, have something to be safe about, whether that's themselves, an at-risk family member, or some other friends for that they're getting together with over the weekend. So please know that you're coming into a controlled environment where us as employees and those working out next to you all have something important to live for. I just wanted to talk briefly about why it's a healthy option to be able to come to the club and stay active. One of the main reasons is putting your life on hold and taking a pause from your activity levels in order to avoid any troubles that might come might not be the best option. That risk might be far outweighed by the fact that if you don't stay active, you have other comorbidities and other health issues that might arise down the road. So my challenge to you is to take time to come into the club, take time to be active, and improve your health and wellness so those issues don't arise in the future.